Hershey Entertainment has invited us to check out a suite at the Giant Center and try out all the awesome food you could see at the Giant Center during a Hershey Bears game. Let's see. Hello everyone, I'm Jay. You're watching the Theme Park Foodies, and I'm here for the first time ever invited by Hershey Entertainment to check out a Hershey Bears game down at the Giant Center. I've actually never been inside the Giant Center before. Puck drop is at seven o'clock, and they've invited us to tour a suite. So if you guys wanna see how a suite is, or what a suite looks like, if you're thinking of buying, buying one, Hopefully in this video, I'll be able to give you a proper representation of what that looks like. They've also had some of the ex or some of the executive chefs and the chefs that work here prepare a little uh, display for us to try out all different foods. And of course, I'll be rating them one to 10. But I am very excited to check out the Giant Center for the first time. Uh, they get to have my first Hershey Bears hockey experience and try all the awesome food you can find here at the Giant Center. If you enjoyed the content, please like, subscribe, join us for my time here at the Giant Center. So we were originally in suite two, but now we're in suite 40. A little bit more towards the back, but still I think a great view. For these suites, you actually have to apply for them. So it's not something that you can order like online. You have to fill out a form online and then we'll have like one of their sales associates contact you. The array of foods that we're having tonight are gonna to be located on the menu. Some things are included. Coffee is included. Soft drinks are included. The hard alcohols, things like that, which we will see here tonight, unfortunately are not included. I think it makes sense. Usually the bars are a little bit extra. Uh, and every all oh, the food we'll eat is on the menu. And a lot of the things, most of the things, are from the vendors downstairs. So they have some smokehouse nachos. They have uh, this s'more spread. So I'm going to try to get a little pick of everything. They also have crab cakes that look really good. Um, I want to thank uh, Gabrielle uh, for coming out and inviting us, as well as Kathy. Uh, and, I mean, the suite itself, it has probably about 14 seats. So you get, there's about 14 seats to sit, as well as some uh, back... Uh, kind of like a desk or bar seating. It has hockey sticks hanging from the back. Yeah, it's just a, a really nice setup. Uh, you also, if you're part of a program, I believe they also have uh, some larger seating down more towards the ice. Uh, I think Puck Drop is at seven. I'm excited to try the food out. So I'm, the, I'm Ben Bedard, um, Walter Figaro. He is the, the sweet chef and special event. This is Lady Joe Color, Chef Joe. And she does all the desserts, came up with all the ideas. And these are the team that make the sweets happen. So any questions, there will be folks. Enjoy the food. Thank you. Hi everyone. How are you today? Are you good? Yes. We have a long wall and fast paint, so it's three beef. Here we have a big beef. It's a smoking big beef from the same recipe we use in the Hershey Park too, in the small house. Just we make a little more premium service presentation for here, right? Uh, we have the, the video of it, so I'm, I'll definitely put that up before I try it. So, let's see how the crab tastes. Mm. Got some good crab. I had crab today, it's probably five. That's great. Tastes fresh, does not taste cold or anything. Eight. Very good. Alright, so I'm gonna try the beef or the It's beef, it's not It has that smokehouse flavor to it. 
Smokehouse is a tendency to drive. This is a drive. Could be a little less well done. Something with a six, but it could easily be a seven. I'm going with six. Right, so the Gouda cheese, they really sold with the going over all this stuff. So this is the Gouda cheese on the Bruchetta. Uh, Started my first live hockey game. All right, so they say the harvest salad is very popular here. I'm gonna try this out. It's got some feta on top of it, some candied walnuts. The game was just going on in the back. Oh, there's a really good. Oh, I'm not being a sweet to my salad, but that might be the best thing I've so far. Maybe another eight though. I'm gonna try some of the fried cheese in the charcuterie board. Good seven. All right, so in park, the smokehouse nachos are probably Sam's favorite thing. I gotta try to eat them and not make a mess. My issue again is that they're cold, but that's my fault. And it's where you can get the smokehouse nachos from Hershey Park here. And they also have a stand downstairs. So if you don't have a suite, you're here. All this food, you go down the stands, it's right available to you downstairs. Smokehouse nachos are good. They're probably, this and the crab cake are my two favorite savory things. And that skillet is just out of this world. Um, give those a solid nine. Uh, I'll give it eight, again, nine if they were hot. I'm just gonna go nine because it's my fault they're cold, so not. All right, so the s'more skillet is probably the sweet thing that enticed me the most. The fire and grain s'more skillet is exceptional. I think it's cooled down a little bit because people were going at it and I saw it was about to go, so I had to get it. Warm, that'd be like a nine for me. I just love fresh melted hot chocolate. Right now it's probably about an eight, but if I got it early, I definitely would be a nine. All right, so I definitely gotta try out one of these fresh waffles. Looks like they have some powdered sugar on top, and they got like a strawberry type of uh, like dressing on top. Of it. Good fresh. They also have a chocolate sauce and a caramel sauce there. I think I'm gonna try the cookie with the chocolate sauce. I'll give it a solid seven, it's good. All right, last thing's I'm gonna try the cookie, drip through the chocolate, and the brownie. Let's hope I don't make a mess. The cookie's okay, but you can't go with wrong with melted chocolate in Hershey. How well they it. Makes it an eight. I think that entire board, it's very good if you have a group of people. Especially if you run one of these boxes out. There's a lot of people here. People can pick at it. You get a little bit of everything. I'm gonna try the brownie out now. Soft is good. I've had better brownies in Hershey, it's good. I mean, it's a solid six. Everything's above five. Everything's above average. Especially as far as sweets go. You can go with sweets in Hershey. 
So they brought us whoopie pies. Peanut butter filling. These are like the whoopie pies you can find in the park. There was a chocolate chip one and a confetti one. The peanut butter is my favorite. My dad says these are the best things in all Hershey bars. What's up there? Man, it's good. It's like a Reese's whoopie pie. Amazing. Definitely a solid, uh, that's a nine. Nine for me, almost a ten. All right, so we have like a three and a half hour, four hour drive home. We're heading out just a little bit early. It was really cool. It was my first ever hockey game live. First time at the Giant Center. Food was amazing. The highlights were definitely the smokehouse nachos as well as those crab cakes. And I would definitely recommend checking out the s'mores skillet. Also, there's numerous different food options even if you don't have a smoothie here. East Coast Mini Donuts, which has two different locations in the park and is just franchised, actually has a location down there. I was able to see them. Definitely recommend them. Always nice, always fresh, delicious made mini donuts. They also have a certain of other options that you can get even if you're not at the suite. So definitely some great food to be found here at the Giant Center. Thanks so much for watching. If you enjoyed the content, please like and subscribe. Liking will really help our channel grow. It pushes this video out there into the stratosphere of the YouTube algorithm. Helps other people find the video. Subscribing also helps our channel grow. Hit the bell notification so that way you're notified every time the videos come out, which is every Monday and Thursday at 12 p.m. Thanks so much for watching. Don't count the days. Make the days count. See you next time. That's all, folks. It's really cool, too, is they have all these different pictures throughout the Giant Center. So you can see people who have played here as well as other Hershey Bears games.